Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if this is your first time here. My name is Latia B. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing some products from a company called Bell Bar. And Bell Bar is an all natural, organic, customizable skincare and hair care company. So I actually won these products in a um, contest, believe it or not. I definitely didn't expect to win because I never win contests. <laughs> but surprisingly, I did win this contest. And um, the contest was um, hosted by Bell Bar, of course, and Curly Girl Collective. This box is super cute. When you first open it, there's a little note on the top of the box here. I'm not going to read it because it is a lot. <laughs> Um, but there are a number of products in here and some of them are already open because I have used them um, which you will see later in the video. But the first product we have is the grapeseed hair oil and this is just a blend of a number of oils and this has oils such as grapeseed, olive oil, henna, fenugreek, castor oil, vitamin C, rosemary, peppermint, and tea tree oil. There is also the Razul Clay Hair Cleanser. And this contains razul clay, vitamin C, aritha, bitter melon, hibiscus, witch hazel, slippery elm, and honey. Next up is the Chad Shavy Powder Growth Hair Mask, which is supposed to encourage growth and thickness in kinky hair. And this one contains a lot of ingredients. <laughs> it has shavy powder, or avocado fruit powder, cassia powder, fenugreek powder, amla powder, maki powder, avocado seed powder, burdock root, ginseng, parsley, stinging nettle, babasu oil, apple seed oil, and Jamaican castor oil. So yes, y'all, that is a lot of things in here. And this one is actually comes in powder form. And you'll see me use this later in the video as well. Next is the green tea tea rinse. And this contains lavender, calendula, chamomile, black tea, green tea, comfrey, sage, red clover, and hops. And lastly is the henna hair gloss. And this contains salt palmetto, marshmallow root, green tea, um, henna, basil, apple cider vinegar, avocado root, and maca root. Lastly, there is the welcome card. So basically, just you know, it tells you about the products a little bit. And then there's a directions card, and it includes directions for both the hair care products and the face products. But I didn't receive the skincare products, but you know that is okay. <laughs> um, so yeah. Basically, Bell Bar Organic is committed to creating premium, all natural, non-toxic versions of your favorite beauty products. So in this video, I, the only three products that I used out of this box were the oil, the Razul Clay hair cleanser, and the growth hair mask. I did not use the tea rinse, um, basically because I just didn't want to make the tea just yet, because you can use this as a rinse or you can use it as a spray every day. So I think I may try to do that. Um, just to help bring in some moisture into my hair and just allow you know those really good teas to kind of sit in my hair and then i also did not use the henna hair gloss because i was afraid to use it to be honest because you know that i do have some um, highlighted portions in my hair so i wasn't sure if it was going to turn the lighter parts of my hair a different color so if you can give me any information about that please let me know down in the comment section if you have lightened hair how your hair responds to henna because i do want to try it because i feel or oh, i've heard and i have seen that it has some like amazing benefits to natural hair but again I'm just nervous to use it because I don't want my hair to turn some kind of funky color <laughs> but anyway y'all make sure that you stay tuned to the end of this video um, to one get my opinions on the products that I did use and two to see my final results First, I'm going in with the Razul Clay Hair Cleanser, and this contains ingredients such as Razul Clay, Vitamin C, Aretha, Bitter Melon, Hibiscus, Witch Hazel, Slippery Elm, and Honey. This product does have an earthy smell. It does not smell like your typical uh, product that you'll find on the market, and that's because it does not have any added fragrances into it. So, like it says, it is organic and all natural.
this is what the scrub looks like it kind of just feels soft with some grainy um, particles in it if that makes sense at all um so i just took a bit of the scrub and then started to massage it into my scalp and honestly y'all this process was super messy i'm not sure if i will use this scalp scrub again as is just because of the mess that it left on my floor however my scalp did feel nicely exfoliated and felt really good afterwards after I finished scrubbing my scalp with the cleanser, I did go ahead and rinse it out, but then I followed up with a regular shampoo just to make sure that my hair was well cleansed. Um, I felt that there were some particles left over from the um, clay cleanser, so I just wanted to make sure that I got all of that out. I then went in with the Chaby Powder Moisture Retention Hair Mask and this hair mask is full of amazing ingredients such as Chaby Powder, Avocado Fruit Powder, Cassia Powder, Fenugreek Powder, Amla Powder, Maqui Powder, Avocado Seed Powder, Burdock Root, Ginseng Parsley, Stinging Nettle, Babasu Oil, Apple Seed Oil, and Jamaican Castor Oil. Whew, that's a mouthful. <laughs> to use this product, you're supposed to add in two teaspoons of the hair mask powder to a small amount of warm water and then stir it to soften the lumps. And then you can add it into a conditioner of your choice or blend it with fresh ingredients. You are then supposed to whip the mixture until it's smooth and well incorporated. After which I applied liberally, as it states on the package, to freshly washed hair and I covered it with a shower cap and then I left this mixture in my hair for about an hour. So this is what my hair looks like after, ooh, sorry, <laughs> after I did the scalp detox and then I went ahead and deep conditioned my hair. So this is what my hair is looking like right now. It's a little dry because it has been in that towel. But y'all, my hair is so freaking soft. It's super soft and you can see that my curls are really defined. And if I were to add product to my hair right now, they would be even my hair would be even more defined and of course less frizzy. But I really like my results so far. So yes, like I said in the video, I had a little issue with the scalp. Um, scrub because I didn't like how like I didn't like the application process it was just really messy so I probably wouldn't use it that way again I mean I do have like a good amount left so I may just add this to like a Razul clay um DIY hair mask type of deal rather than use it as a massage scrub I mean excuse me rather than use it as a scalp scrub because it was just too much of a mess <laughs> on the other hand the hair mask i loved it um now both of these products because they are organic all natural and contain so many like um ingredients from the earth they do have an earthy smell so you're not gonna smell like your you know really good fragrance filled <laughs> hair care products it's not gonna smell like that so do not think it's gonna smell like that because it's not it smells very earthy that's not to say that it smells bad it just has a um, scent that i'm not used to however with that being said none of the scents of any other products were overbearing at all so that's really good for me because you know i am sensitive to scents um but overall y'all like i really enjoyed the products that i did use i feel like this oil will also be really good if i you know stay committed to it and i use it on a daily basis like they recommend i feel like i'll probably see some really great results um but when i try the other products that came in this box i will definitely um, be sure to record it and let you guys know what my opinions are of those products and i will also leave information for bell bar organic down in the description box so you can go ahead and check it out and if you've ever heard of bell bar organic or if you ever use any bell bar organic products i would love to know what your thoughts are on them i feel like it's really cool when you know brands try to take the our favorite products and make it into healthier versions 
for us to use because I mean who really wants to use a chemical filled product on their hair their skin or whatever you know so I really commend them for taking this step to really just make um, really good for you and really good quality products and have it out there on the market but anyway enough of my rambling I'm hoping this video does not end up being too long I do hope that you all enjoyed it and please let me know like I said down in the comment section if you ever tried this product on um, these products or if you're interested in trying these products or if you have any other like organic and just high quality natural brands that are like your go-to's let me know those down in the comment section as well and do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and definitely don't forget to hit that subscribe button y'all know I love my subscribers speaking of the subscriber that's getting the shout out today is Miss Tawanda Johnson I just want to thank you so much you are always watching my videos you're always giving me encouraging words and I truly appreciate your support and I do hope that you continue watching my videos <laughs> um, but if you want to be shouted out in my next video um, then be sure that you are active on my channel you are subscribed to my channel and if you want to increase your chances of being um, shouted out on my channel then make sure that you're active on my instagram page as well you can find me at so dazzling it is the same as my youtube channel so it's super easy to find make sure that you're liking pictures commenting and just making sure just make sure that you're visible just make sure i can see you i mean i want i want to see you okay <laughs> anyway y'all i will see y'all in my next video and do not forget to stay dazzling